Hi, how are y'all doing today? It's Norma's from Norma's Creative Art. And tonight we're going to do the wave that I promised that uh, last night. I'll take the camera down onto the canvas. I'm using an 18 by 24. And tonight the colors that we'll be using are the Creative Inspirations of Phthalo Blue, the uh, Pouring Masters Aquamarine, we've got the Masters Touch Lilac, we have the Masters Touch Sapphire, we have the Masters Touch White, Ocean Green, and we have the Masters Touch uh, Sky Blue. So I'm uh, also I have a little bit of yellow with white in it to give it a little bit of highlight. Okay, tonight we're going to attempt the wave and I'm going to have the wave break this way. This is an 18 by 24 canvas. And I am actually painting this for my son because tomorrow is his birthday. So I hope to post this on his birthday and say happy birthday back. So he loves the beach. So I'm going to attempt to do a wave. And I watched Molly on Molly's artist, artistry last night to watch it again because she does one of the prettiest waves. So I'm going to put the white in just this corner to begin with. And I'm going to blow it out and blow it off the canvas because that way is what, how she spreads the, the, um, her paint is just, I think I need a little bit more. Is just by taking and putting it on here and then blowing it with the hairdryer. So she already gets the starts the effect of the wave just with the hairdryer. So that started our canvas and now I'm going to come in and cover the canvas. I'm not going to cover the whole canvas. I'm just going to start and put the waves in and then when I blow it, uh, it'll cover the canvas. So this is the consistency and I'm going to start with the darkest blue. This is the phthalo blue. A little bit more down in this corner. A little bit more in this corner. Okay. Then I'm going to come in with the, the um, green, the aquamarine. I'm 
I want it to look like waves, so I'm trying to just put some different colors in. A lot of colors, so um, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a lighter color. I'm going to put this um, ocean green that um, is very pretty. But in, in Corpus Christi area, we have, we have a greenish tint to our waves, uh, to our, that's a little bit thick. Um, we have a greenish tint to our waves uh, because we have the oil, it's just narrow. Um, we're not real deep. We're not a deep, the gulf is not deep. So they have more of a green. Uh, tint in their ocean color. Now when you get to South Padre, it's really, really blue down by Port Isabel and uh, down at South, South Padre. But in Corpus Christi, it, it, most of the time it's uh, uh, got a green tint to it. Okay, and now I want to put right here, I'm going to wait for that one. Um, I'm going to put the sky blue in next. I'm going to put uh, some white. I, I want to take and uh, drizzle white throughout so that it looks like we have waves. This is so that it'll cover the canvas in here. I want to put a little bit of yellow and a little bit of purple in mine, just to give it, a, a, and this is yellow and white, and I only wanna put it in a couple of places. I'm gonna put it here by the white and I want to put it up here by the white as if the sun's hitting it and then I just want a teeny touch of the lilac into here just as the wave okay now I haven't been having real good success with my waves so hopefully tonight's will be a little bit different. So here we go. in there because I touched it with my blow dryer. I'll do that in a minute.
I'm going to stop for a minute and uh, put some blues back in. I really like this effect. Very, very pretty. I don't worry about those white and those uh, spots. I'm going to uh, fix them in a minute. I just want to drizzle a little bit more blue into it because I lost my phthalo blue. And I love the deep. But I, I love this effect already. So I need to get, I need to get um, the white back down in here. Now, I have gotten a little uh, blow dryer that, um, let's see if we can get some of those spots out by just touching them. I'll put a little bit more white back in. I'm going to put a little white here because it's not covering the canvas. I'm going to blow it out with a, the little blower. My, my white might have been too thick, and that might be why it's giving me a little bit of problems. Love this effect. Absolutely love this effect. So let's see if this little little blow dryer that I got from Amazon works and see if we can blow some of those out. See if it moves it, if it moves the paint. I just want to blow it out a little bit. Uh, Molly can do it with her breath. I can't do it with my breath because I have asthma so it doesn't work, but this is not working either. So I might have to... Um, Definitely do it with a straw. Love this effect. This effect is just really pretty. Um, where I have a problem is right there in the middle because I didn't get enough white paint on it to begin with. And I'm going to actually um, take my tool and try to move some of the paint around. And then I'm going to come back in there with a the hairdryer and try to blow it. Really love this effect. See, my paint is already setting up. And so I'm gonna to have to pour a little bit of paint back in here because it's already setting up. And it won't move if it, if it sets up. I, I really like the whole effect. So I just need to get paint on the, on the canvas and get it leveled. Might be able to touch this a little bit and get some of those spots out. Putting my finger in it, aren't I? Okay. 
Okay, let me put a little more paint right here. Okay, I added some white. Now I'm going to try to blow it out and see if I can blow it back into the wave. Because I really do like it when I, uh, it is dried. I hope it's level. Even if it's not level, waves are not level. So water's not level. So I really don't mind it. Uh, when it's uh, set up, I will bring it down to show it to you. And hopefully, Pat, you enjoy it for your birthday because this is yours. Well, here's our wave. I think it turned out pretty darn good. And this is my uh, son's birthday present. And I'm going to take it. Uh, it's not dry. It's um, just been done. I'm hoping the white levels out a little bit more. But let's take it down for a closer look. And then tomorrow I will show you a picture of it. I love the way the colors are intermingling and the, the yellow is in there the greens love the dark blues love the movement i would say so far this is my most successful wave and i've tried a few i'm still going to try that big one thank you well Happy birthday, Pat. Here it is on your birthday. And it's not dry, but it uh, is looking really good. I'm going to take you down for a closer look of it. See all the pretty lacing. And all the different colors in it.
the yellow. Well, I hope you like it. If you liked what I did, please hit like and subscribe. Have a great day.